Tell me all you need And I will try So are you going to tell me what this is about? Maybe you should tell me about it Well, what's that supposed to mean? Peyton told me some things about the two of you Look, Brooke, I know that you're worried about my past with Peyton But you have to understand the circumstances this time, you know? I mean, God, she was bleeding, and she thought she was gonna die. I mean, the kiss, it meant nothing. What kiss? Did you kiss her again? I need you to listen to me, okay? I understand that you didn't know about the kids, and I'm sorry for springing on you, but I meant what I said. It didn't mean anything. A kiss always means something. Okay, maybe you're right, but it wasn't a romantic moment, and you would know that. If what, I was there? As you so sweetly pointed out at the party, the party that I threw for you, I wasn't there, was I? Is it impossible for you to forgive me? I forgave you. For what? For sleeping with Chris Keller. And you know what, Lucas? I loved you for that. You had such grace in that moment that I fell in love with you all over again. I can't believe that you would use it now as a bargaining chip. Oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. I just, I need you to trust me and believe me when I tell you that my heart is with you. But a part of me feels like ever since we got back together, you've just been waiting, waiting to push me away. Oh, great. You kiss Peyton again, and I'm pushing you away. God, why don't I make everybody identical persons as wedding gifts? I love you, Brooke. I don't know how else to say it. How about how you show it? I am not pushing you away, Lucas. I am holding on for dear life, but I need you to need me back. Okay, why wouldn't you tell me about the kiss? And why didn't you call me while you were away? And why won't you ever just let me all the way in? Please don't be mad, Brooke. 